Hey guys, I just wanted to show you my new book. It's called A Different View. Um, it's an exclusive, well at this stage, a one of one. Well, one of two actually, because they gave me two copies. It's um, produced by an amazing company called Memento Pro. They're a family business and they sort of specialize in photographic books, um, stationery, all sorts of stuff like that. But the book is just... I've never seen anything like it. The printing quality is is second to none. In fact, I don't think I've actually seen any printing as good as this before. I've had I've done six books myself, and when I opened this book for the first time, I was blown away by how accurately my photos were reproduced. In fact, they looked photographic, and if you put these next to the prints that I make in my gallery, they would be pretty much identical. We're probably going to make this into a limited edition run and I'm thinking maybe 250 or 500 possibly. So um, the book itself is 100 pages with over 100 images and it has a beautiful cloth cover. A little bit about it, Memento Pro. They were established in 2002. It's a family business and uh, they were Australia's first on-demand book service. And, um, you know, they've obviously taken what they do to the next level. I know that they've had, they've done a lot of work on uh, their design tools and their ICC profiles to make sure that your book comes out and the photos come out exactly as you expect. I know, I, I know Les Walkling has done some work with these guys to help them uh, with all their color managed and production workflow and stuff. So yeah, excellent stuff. Well, anyway, um, keep an eye out on my website because I'm pretty sure we will uh, put this into some sort of production and uh, we'll be offering them as a limited edition. Uh, again, it's like these are the images in this book are my favorites. They're all my, it's a collection of my contemporary work. So uh, you, you may or may not have seen some of it, um, but it's all the stuff that I really love shooting. It's not the pretty landscapes, it's the urban banal and um, the, yeah, the industrial stuff and, and the, yeah, the kind of crazy altered landscapes. So. Hopefully, as soon as that's out, I'll be able to let you know and put it up on my website.